Royals visiting the Phillies for their home opener. Two of the best third basemen to ever play the game, George Brett and Mike Schmidt, uniting before the game to throw out a ceremonial first pitch. Bottom of the second inning, Phillies up 1-0. Dominic Brown takes Wade Davis deep and gone to right field. His first of the year made it 2-0 Phillies. Later in the inning, with one out, Eric Kratz at the dish, and he takes Davis deep and gone to left field. His first of the season, Phillies up 3-0. Next inning, Kyle Kendrick on the hill against Alex Gordon, who skies one into shallow center field. Ben Revere coming on strong, and he makes the nice diving catch. Take another look, full extension on the play. Top of the fifth inning, bases loaded, two outs. Eric Hosmer pokes a single to right field. That scores Miguel Tejada and Alex Gordon. Royals are on the board. It's 4-2. In the top of the sixth, Kendrick would intentionally walk Billy Butler to load the bases, and then Jeremy Horst comes in. So bases loaded, two outs. Alex Gordon looking to do damage. Fastball that was up, and it's driven to right center field and all the way to the wall. And Alex Gordon is going to clear the bases. He is on his way to third for a triple. And the Royals take the lead with a three-run sixth inning. Gordon absolutely unloading on that one in the gap. And that would not be the end of the offense for the Royals. Top of the seventh, bases loaded, one out. Kansas City up six to four now. Chris Getz trying to break this game wide open. Getz goes the other way. And it's going to be a diving miss by Brown. And for the second time in two innings, a Royal is going to have a three-run triple. The Royals would tack on two more runs in both the eighth and ninth innings. Alcides Escobar with a solo shot in the eighth and a double in the ninth, helping to bring in the runs. Kansas City wins 13-4. The Phillies' bullpen allows eight of the 13 runs. Eric Hosmer with a fantastic game, four for five, three RBI, and a double.